this video, let us see how to identify the quadrants in which any point lies. To start off, let us consider the point 4, 2. So what we need to do now is find the quadrant in which 4, 2 lies. Speaking of quadrants, we already know that this is the Cartesian coordinate axis. This is the x-axis and this is the y-axis. It's a distinct x dash o x and y dash o y. So here we have. Now, let us plot some points here. Say now, we know that o x is plus and o y is plus and OX dash is negative and OY dash is also negative. So, this will be, here it will be negative. Now, as we know that this point 4 comma 2 is an ordered pair and 4 is the abscissa and 2 is the ordinate. Axis also means x-axis, ordinate also means y-axis. And also the way the quadrants are numbered is like this. This is the first quadrant, this is the second quadrant, this is the third quadrant and this is the fourth quadrant. So this is what we need to identify. Which quadrant does 4, 2 lie? As we can see, positive 4 x-axis is here and positive 2 y-axis is here. So so, if we plot these points, the point lies here. So, the point lies, the first point lies in the first quadrant. So, this lies in the first quadrant. Now, let us look into another point. Say, minus 3, 5. Now, where does minus 3, 5 lie? Minus 3, we have to check out the x-axis. So, this is x-axis and minus 3 is here. Plus 5 is the positive y-axis and here it is. So, it lies somewhere. If you plot the points, it lies exactly here. So, the second point lies in the second quadrant. So, we can write here, this lies in the second quadrant. Let us look into another point. Say, minus 2, comma, minus 5. Now, minus 2, the starting is x-axis. The first number of an ordered pair is x-axis. So, minus 2 lies here. And minus 5 of y-axis lies here. So, we plot this. We get here something. Third point lies in the third quadrant. And then, we have 4, comma, minus 2. 4 is again positive and x-axis. So, here it is. Minus 2 is negative y-axis. That is this one. So, therefore, we need to plot it somewhere here. So, this is the fourth point. Fourth point lies in the fourth quadrant. So, it's as simple as this. So, all you have to do if you want to find which quadrant a point is lying in, you need to just draw a coordinate axis and then plot the points and then you'll know which quadrant it lies in.